Hey, what's up, everybody? It's February 2nd, 2018. The storm is lagging a bit, so I thought I would do a really awesome videos for you guys because I learned last night how to uh, how to attach these videos so I can make them longer and do like one cut here, one cut there. So this is over on Highway 38, guys, on that long, long stretch. The storms come from this way, but I want you guys to get a good view of San Gorgonio. Oh, well, this isn't San Gorgonio. I think that's Sugarloaf Mountain. But oh my gosh, just has tons of snow on it. Looks so pretty, you guys. This is Highway 38. I haven't done any videos on here in a long time. So you can see, and Hatchery Road. And then we got, yeah, so you can see the clouds kind of rolling in over these hills right here. But the storm's running late, you guys. So I'm gonna drive up to uh, near Onyx Summit, take some video from there. I'm gonna take some video from over on Highway 18 on the back side, and then on the front. But look at the roads, guys. You guys are fine. There's no snow, there's no ice yet. There's nothing on the roads, you're fine. I'm riding my motorcycle, so don't worry, you'll be fine. All right, that's video number one. I'm gonna attach them later. I'm gonna try my best. Peace out, guys. Thank you guys for everything and all the nice comments. I love you guys. Right, guys, this is part two of this video. Um, I went up to Onyx Summit. And guys, this is the highest point of your drive of any direction in Big Bear. So when you're coming up here, this is gonna be your highest point. This is the summit of your drive on Highway 38. It doesn't get any higher up in, in, in altitude than this on your road. Look at the roads, guys. Nothing, no snow, no ice. Nothing yet. And we're gonna be heading back down this way right now. And I'm gonna go over to the back of Highway 18 and do a shot over there. Um, so you guys can see what the desert looks like right now and then I'm gonna go back over and maybe go to fawn skin do a little one over there and then one over by the Big Bear Dam and we're good take care guys I gotta take a leak so excuse me for a moment can't show you guys that you trust me you don't want to see that peace I don't want to scare you guys so check this out driving down and up highway 38 I, I forgot to tell you but when I was driving up here they have this going on and I saw big old flames all over here. Nobody even near them, you guys. I don't know what the, like, uh, I know they're like trying to fucking burn this fucking dry shit, but dude, there were fucking flames everywhere, dude. I don't know what the fuck they're doing, but they must know what they're doing. But uh, yeah, so this is still Highway 38, guys. What I'm pointing at right now is the desert. That's the desert, but we're gonna get a much better view of that in just a moment. So this is still Highway 38. This is that long stretch where, you, where I, I can get really fast on my bike. But yeah, so there's uh, yeah. Anyway guys, and it's so pretty around here. It really is just so pretty. You see the clouds rolling in over there. We're gonna get really good views, guys, shortly. See you guys in a minute. Now we're going to Highway 18. I fucking lied earlier, I'm sorry. Peace out. You know what, on the way back to Highway 38, guys, or Highway 18 on the backside, I want to stop in Baldwin Lake so you guys can check out Baldwin Lake. I mean, this is the opposite end of Bear Valley, guys. This is it. This is the other end of Bear Valley over there. Where I live, where all those clouds are way over there. But this is the other end of town, and town is eight miles long, you guys. So to get to the Big Bear Dam from here, as the crow flies, it's eight miles that way. But anyway, this is really pretty. Just gorgeous, guys. Get 
how sunny it is. It's so pretty over here. So guys, whenever I, I talk about all the storms, they dissipate and whatnot. Well guys, out here, if we get like six inches of snow over by the dam, they'll only get like an inch of snow out here, maybe. It's always like that. The storms hit all this dry air right here and the clouds just dissipate. Like if we just watch that one, it'll probably just fucking disappear. But anyway, now I'm heading to the back of Highway 18, guys. All right, guys, so we're almost at, like, uh, I just drove down a little bit from the summit of Highway 18 on the backside because uh, I can get the, the better views just a little bit below it. So this is where we're at, just below the summit on the backside. This is the desert side. Oh my God, you guys, just spectacular over here. I wouldn't be surprised if they don't get any snow over here. How weird is that, guys? It really is. But anyway, yeah, this is just absolutely magnificent. Guys, I live in such an incredible place. Like, look at how high up we are. Look at the desert, man. Just magnificent. Fucking tree. Here, let me walk, walk down here a little bit. Hopefully no one hits me. Yeah, guys, dude, if, it, God, if I had that fucking GoPro, there was so much cool stuff that you guys would have seen on this drive. Like big old fires in the forest and shit. Um, there was nowhere I could stop to see those flames for you guys, but unfortunately, you know what? I'm, I'm, in the, you know, I'm, I'm in the road right now, what am I doing? I need to be smarter than this, guys, but I just love this so much. God, this is spectacular. And then just look at how fucking high up we are. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Looking out this way is towards like Joshua Tree and whatnot. Out that way. 29 Palms, way out there. Just amazing, guys. Just amazing. So, anyway, we're off like a palm dress. So fucking pretty. Okay. Wow. All right, guys. So next stop, we're turning around and we're heading back up and we're gonna look at the whole valley from up top from the Baldwin Lakeside so we can see everything going out that way. I think that's probably going to be our most incredible views today. So I'm looking forward to this one, guys. Um, thank you guys for all your support. I love doing this, man. I love it. I love you guys. Peace. See you in a minute. So guys, this is the view I was talking about, but I want you guys to see this road. When you're coming up the back side on Highway 18, once you get above town here, on and you start to make that right turn, you'll see a dirt road that goes straight. That's this road. Believe it or not, I've never taken this road before. <laughs> but guys, look at this view, man. It's just amazing. You can see Bear Mountain right there. There's Bear Mountain right there. Just spectacular, you guys. See the clouds rolling in. Unbelievable. This is way above the valley. That's Baldwin Lake right, that's Baldwin Lake down there. And you can see how I always talk about how the storms come in. They come in right over those mountains right there, right there, and they just dump a bunch of snow. Right there, but then they dissipate right here, look. See? It's crazy. But there's no snow falling right now, guys, so nothing to worry about. But I guarantee you, when I get over to that area, over by the dam, like past those clouds, it's going to be very, very cloudy. I'll, I'll be willing to bet. But that's what I love about this town. It's really cool like that. And look at this cloud just creeping over the mountain. So pretty. So, yeah. So anyway, I did not expect anybody to be driving on this road, but that's okay. 
So this is what we got, guys. Now I'm gonna head over to the fawn skin area. If I see another great spot for another good view, I'll, I'll stop and take that. But uh, yeah, guys, it's about 37 degrees. I'm freezing my balls off, but it's cool. I love doing this for you guys. All right, guys, this is another really beautiful spot. This is on, uh, let's see, 18 on the back side. This is a very, very beautiful part of town, you guys. It's like a big old prairie. It's really pretty. And there's Bear Mountain, and there's Snow Summit right there. So guys, we're on the North Shore right now. This is the North Shore. We're still really close to the backside. And this is all part of like Baldwin Lake and the flow into Baldwin Lake. In good years, this whole area is a lake, which is pretty badass. But uh, yeah, pretty badass, guys. And as you can see, the storm's over there. And that's not even storm, those are just pre-frontal pre -frontal clouds, those are nothing. Nothing to get excited about, but it looks really pretty, doesn't it? It looks really pretty. Alright guys, let's go do some more videos over off of uh, the same road in the fawn skin area. And then over by the Big Bear Dam, and then we'll be done I think. So we're at uh, Stanfield Cutoff. I thought I'd stop here. It's a great spot to check out views. Straight ahead is Snow Summit, but you can see the clouds are inundating Snow Summit. And just look at how fast the clouds are rolling in from this perspective. Actually, I don't think you, you can really tell how fast they're rolling in from this perspective, but they're rolling in fast. That's Bear Mountain straight ahead. So let's take a look over towards the Big Bear Dam, see what's going on. Just looks amazing, you guys. And then look, where I just was out there, Baldwin Lake, the backside of Highway 18, there's nothing out there. See, there's nothing, just blue skies. That's where I just was. But the closer you get over here, the more clouds, the more intense it gets, the colder it gets. There's the solar observatory right there. That's the solar observatory. All right, guys, so I'm gonna keep on going down that way on the North Shore side, okay? I might do another two or three little short clips to add to the main video. Take care, guys. All right, people. We're on the North Shore. I love this part of the road. It's such a beautiful part of town. It's such a beautiful part of town. This side of town doesn't get as much snow. Um, you know, as you guys know well by now from what I mentioned all the time, is that you know, all, <coughs> all the storms, uh, they end up hitting right, right up here over these mountains and then they dissipate. <coughs> yeah, so let's take a little walk down here for a second. Check this out. This is a nice little walking path. I dig it, I dig it, I dig it. And yeah. So and then let's just take take a look back here. Yeah, there's some beautiful homes hidden back there on, on those private roads back there. Um, yeah. Anyway, look where we're at now guys. 
back down at the, the beach again. Back down at the mall fucking beach and shit. Damn, it's mall fucking beach and shit. So, I left my bike running. Hopefully no asshole steals it, but you gotta be pretty ballsy if you're gonna steal a bike when it's in the mid 30s. So windy right here guys, holy crap. So damn windy. And as you guys know right there, that's Snow Summit. You can see the chair lifts, you can see little people skiing down. Scoot over, there's Paramount. Can't really see much. That's okay. down to the water's edge again guys Tranquility's over. <laughs> Let's head back to the ride, to my G-Whip. Get back to the motherfucking G-Whip, motherfucking shit. All right. Man, it's just so pretty though. I just want to keep on a sting right here. Man. Seriously, it really is just so pretty right here. Guys, let's make like Tom and Cruz, or let's make like a baby and head out, or make like Jelly and Jam, <laughs> or make like a hockey team and get the puck out of here, <laughs> uh, make like a banana and split. <laughs> I don't fucking know. Oh god. Alright. Uh, make like an asshole and fuck off. <laughs> Yeah, seriously, I really hope I can get all this length video onto one. That would be so cool. Helmet's still on it, that's good. Oh, look at these fuckers on that private road. But they looked like they were going there, so maybe I'm the fucker on the private road. <laughs> anyway, guys, we have a really nice walk, walking path around the lake here. So, anyway. Peace out, my peeps. I'll see you in a minute, yeah? Man, I love doing this for you guys. Peace. We're in fawn skin now, and I guarantee you my bike's probably gonna blow over, but that's okay. So we're in parts of fawn skin. I just wanted to go over and get a good view, because the fence is down over here, so that's good. 
So we're gonna walk over here, and get a nice old, nice old view of the lake and everything from the Fonskin area. I hope you guys can hear me. You probably can't. So cold, man. Holy shit, it's windy as hell. Big Bear Lake all over there. You can see Snow Summit is right there. And Bear Mountain is right there. Just so you guys have perspectives from where I'm shooting from. I'll show you guys this tarp up here and you'll be able to see how hard, how fast the wind's blowing. It's fucking blowing, you guys, really hard right now. I mean, look at that. Just blowing. And it is so cold. But yeah guys, this is the Fonskin area. It's such a beautiful area. Such a beautiful area. The further you go that way into Fonskin, the more snow you get. The further you go out this way, the less snow you get. That's just how this town is, guys. So I'll see you in a minute. So I just wanted to stop real quick because this is downtown Fonskin. So I wanted everyone to see downtown Fonskin. Downtown Fonskin's a really cute little town, man. I really like this area. I really like this area an awful lot. It's just kind of like old Mountain West town, man. You got lots of camping sites up here, lots of Boys and Girl Scout stuff to do up here. It's just really, really, really cool. And the clouds are rolling in right here. And look, there's a, a, a new cell phone tower right there. That's cool. They're building it right now as we speak. Super cool. Anyway, look at how fast these clouds are rolling, guys. All right, guys, there's going to be one more stop before the dam, I think. Or maybe two, but probably one. Peace out. See you in a minute. All right, guys, so now we are at the closest, like, we're really close to the Big Bear Dam on the Fonskin side, but I always love this part because it's a beautiful, beautiful portion to take great pictures and views. So that's looking back into the Fonskin area, guys. Just spectacular, man. Unbelievable. So once again, that's Snow Summit right there. That's Bear Mountain over there. So you're getting the perspective of me driving around the lake. There's the solar observatory. Remember, we were on the other side and I was pointing it out coming this way. So this is where we're at now. Next stop, Big Bear Dam, guys. But you gotta see how fast these clouds are going though, it's insane.
Alright, let's go to the damn dam. Let's go to the damn dam. Alright guys, so I decided to drive a little bit past the dam. So the dam's right there. But I want you guys just to see what, where all these clouds come from. And they it's right here and then they dissipate. Here we go. So this is this is looking out guys, way out towards like Snow Valley and whatnot. Um, it's a pretty amazing view over here. And look at how high of a drop off this is dude. Oh shit. Oh my god dude, that's insane. I don't want to eat shit. Don't want to eat shit. Yeah guys, this is just amazing. This is the little Arctic Circle. This drive right here. Pretty amazing. So this is heading out of town, but we're gonna turn around and go back this way. So we can go to the dam real quick. Alright guys, we've arrived at the Big Bear Dam. We made it! We definitely made it. So we're here at the dam. The dam dam. But like you guys can see, it's totally cloudy here. This is the snowiest part of the town, you guys, right here. This is where it gets the most snow in the whole town. This part and Boulder Bay. And up there's the dam keeper's house. I don't know if you can see it, but it's right there. Anyway guys, we made it to the Big Bear Dam. We made it all points of town. I might make one more stop and then I'm uh, gonna upload this video. Should be a pretty cool video if I can do it right. Cross them out and put a K to these motherfuckers, man. Fucking taggers, dude. Bunch of fucking faggots. Fucking can't stand people who destroy our fucking town up here, dude. This is everyone's town, people. This is for everybody. Look out there towards Baldwin Lake, you, there's not a cloud in the sky. Seriously, it's the most trippy thing, you guys. <laughs> so, so look at how nice it looks out there. And then when I turn around, not, not looking so nice anymore. Watch. Let's head back, you guys.
So the road that I came on, okay, so that road over there, I came from that direction. So I basically went around the town that way. All right, guys, till next one. What's up, my people? I thought we'd make a stop at Boulder Bay because it's a beautiful spot. This is the pop thing about Boulder Bay right here. Alright, so this is Boulder Bay guys, one of the most beautiful parts of town I would say. Just amazingly beautiful. And this part of town gets an awful lot of snow too. So it's, it's pretty bad. Some beautiful homes just right here. That's such a beautiful spot, you guys. That's a beautiful spot. tell that's west so the big bear dams right over there and we are over here we're not gonna walk down on this dock but I just wanted you guys to see how pretty Boulder Bay is it's such a gorgeous little place to live in such a spectacular part of town and as I said snow's the most here out of the whole town snowiest part of town this and the, the big bear dam so That's so pretty guys. I wish the lake had more water, but it is what it is. All right. I want to live in one of those homes right there, man. Pretty sick. fast. Keep looking back, motherfucker. You wanna fucking try and take my bike? I'll fucking kill you. Alright. Wow, look at that fucking jet up there. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's fucking hauling ash. Damn! Things almost out of the picture already. So, guys, this is Boulder Bay. Um, once again, one of my favorite parts of town. I would love to live right here. So, if anyone wants to move up and be my roommate, let me know. We'll fucking we'll 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 get a pad together. All right. So, the next stop, guys, I think is going to be uh, probably home. I'm not sure. No, there's one more spot. Easy. All right, guys, it's probably going to be the last stop. This is on that straightaway right here. And it's just a beautiful sight, man. It's just a beautiful sight here. I love it. So the Performing Arts Center is just right up here to the right. We're really close to town, guys. I want you guys to see just how beautiful it is. And look at these clouds coming in here. That's the fawn skin area, guys, over there, across the lake, over there. Fawn skin, over there. Just amazing, guys.
All right, guys, that might be the last one on this clip. Hopefully I can get these all on here for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it. it took me almost three hours, <laughs> but it's worth it. Peace out, guys. Yeah, you know what? I thought this would be a, a decent shot. This is right above the, uh, the village, okay? So if you take that road up, this is it. This, it, it dead ends right up here. So this is right above the, the Big Bear Lake village, you guys. You just take this road down. It drops you right in the center of the village. But I got up this road by coming through the village, so. But yeah. All right, guys, that's it. That's it today. Oh, by the way. Uh, thank you, guys. I appreciate you guys watching. I hope you enjoyed this this video. This video took a lot of work. All right, I'm heading home. Peace out, guys. Be safe. Hey guys, forgive me, I wanted to get one last perspective, the one I didn't get, the Moon Ridge perspective. So this is Bear Mountain, guys. We're at Bear Mountain Ski Resort right here. I mean, I can literally walk right out onto the ski resort. This is where I work, but I wanted you guys to see the view from up here. There's the lake right there. Here's the beginner runs over here, this whole side. All beginner runs. But look at these clouds are blown in right over the top of Bear. Alright guys, so that's it. I really wanted you guys to at least get this perspective on top of everything else. And right on. Alright guys, that's it for the day. Hope I can get this thing to work. Peace out guys. I had a lot of fun today.